Hello everyone, I'm Greg Luke, thank you for joining me, and welcome back to episode 111 of Factorio with the Sheep mod, where we keep working towards advanced circuits, and I think now we only need resin and ferric chloride, because we have silicon, we have silver, we have plastic, and we have aluminium. And we just need to figure out what we need to work off of resin and ferric chloride. Ferric chloride is a little bit annoying because it is both petrochemical stuff and resource processing stuff. So I don't know whether to build it right below us here at the petrochemical area or over at resource processing. But let's just have a look at this. We get chlorine from saline water electrolysis. That gives us sodium hydroxide. I think we're already doing that process somewhere. And then just burning the chlorine, I guess. Would we get enough out of this is a good question. We don't really need a lot. 10 per second. The aluminium is... do we need all of this for this recipe? Yes, we do. Did we do twice this reduction by any chance? No. So did we not plan to use aluminium for any other things? That's a little bit stupid, I think. Might just be because it would have been too much. No, we're doing it by processing a byproduct of this junk sorting. I guess that's why. If we at some point can sort directly for aluminium, then we can start producing a lot more. <coughs> I think that makes sense. But still, we are producing more than enough chlorine to also support ferric chloride. So let's. I guess we need some machines first of all. Is this everything? I think we have all of that. Oh, those three machines, yes indeed. We can also just scale this up quite a bit because we probably need the phenolic ports for other things. modules so yeah we do if we ever get to modules i'm not sure but we can scale it up a little bit at least or build it in a way that can scale at least but we have everything i think so let's just go and try and do this so we wait we get the fluid out of this but it doesn't make sense to do everything else here so we do we are going to have a pipe on the belt bus, I guess. And maybe that's okay. How else would we do it? <laughs> Just out of curiosity, can you get rid of sodium hydroxide? if you wanted to do this at the petrochemical processing area. You could turn it into a sodium hydroxide solution, then you can clarify that. So turn it into sodium, but I don't want to do that. <coughs> But then we would still have to bring this to the petrochemical area, and I would prefer not to do that, I guess. So let's just keep going with building it down here and bringing a pipe onto the bus. 
So we're already taking some of the aluminium and putting down here. We don't need the aluminium. Never mind me. We have iron ore right here that is being fed into other systems. We can leech off of that if we want to. And I do want to. So we have chlorine. Let's get the car out of the way. And we're currently burning the chlorine, but let's put that behind an overflow valve. Because then we can take this and put into a chemical plant. And we need hydrogen in there as well. And we have that here as well. Awesome. And we're also burning that. So only overflow, please. <coughs> These should be able to produce more than enough hydrogen as well. Yes. Good. So this is all backed up by the sodium hydroxide. That's okay for now. The chemical plants. I guess we keep doing underground stuff. This is way too much anyway. Let's maybe stick to two machines to begin with. Oops, chloride. And these are the wrong way around. Great. That's correct, I believe. And if we want to, we can use this stuff up here as well. But let's just start here, I guess. And this output outputs this stuff. That we just put directly into a new chemical plant that does ferric chloride. Where is this stuff? Here it is. Good. Let's do something like this. Just have long inserters. I think we can reach all of that with just one inserter. Good. And as soon as we just take away a little bit of this, we get everything we need. Sodium, no ferric chloride. My bad. Now, where do we want this to go? I'd rather not use a full lane for this. So we could just go between lanes, I guess. That's a possibility. Why don't we run it right next to these catalysts? Let's do that. And those come all the way from down here, so we can figure out where to go. Good. I am almost out of underground pipe, though. Did we leave some here? Yes, let's grab some. Maybe we also have some in the car. No. That should be enough. Do we still have enough iron here? Yes, 4,000. Plenty. We see a little bit of the used catalysts coming back. Oh, we don't have a radar. Too bad. I'm not sure if the petrochemical area actually keeps working on anything. We can 
really use it for plastic. And that should be backed up. Maybe that some small processes still running. not smart to build in right ahead of yourself, I guess. And yes, that's why we don't usually do this, but... Oh. And I need to stop building ahead of myself again. And around here is where we need it. So let's just stop there for now. Okay, so that's the ferric chloride done. Then we needed resin. Let's put that by itself. Liquid resin from urea or from resin. If we get 10 to 40 liquid resin from fall resin and you turn 20 of it into 2, then this is a bad recipe, I guess. So you will on average get, what, 25? So you get 2.5 resin back from 4. Why is this even a thing? Is it just to get rid of ethanol? That doesn't make a lot of sense to me. And this is not something we want, I don't think. Bioresin. Yes, we could try and do it. So out of at least temperate trees. I guess this is only for temperate trees then. What are we currently producing? I think these are just trees. Oh, that's probably not possible either. Though it would be nice. So if we wanted to do something like this, can we do that? Just out of curiosity. I think we are going with the urea gas, but let's see. The raw bioresin stuff. So with this stuff, what is the other things we can get? Bioplastic and bio rubber. Okay. But this stuff, we need farming science for that. And we do have some of that lying around that we can do. I'm not sure how much though. Yeah, not here, but over here. 35, so yeah, not a lot. So I guess urea gas it is. And for melterhide, it just had to be complex, I guess. What do we need? What sort of machines do we need for that? Chemical plants or advanced chemical plants and assembling machines. What about this stuff? Ammonia. 
We don't do that. Ammonia from hydrogen and nitrogen and red metal catalyst. I think that is what we're going to do. I don't want to do this stuff. Blue cellulose I remember to be annoying from the last time we looked at it. So this is what we're going to do. This is all pretty easy. This is as well, we just need to do it at our resource processing area and put it on a hill next to the green catalyst. So that should be urea gas. Lemon formaldehyde is from methanol, which we are producing now. Or the plastic, yes. Okay, so we basically just need chemical plants and red metal catalysts. Let's do red metal catalysts first then. And I think that's just iron and cobalt, right? Uh, yes. So where would be a good place to do that? Somewhere where we have both. Could do it right here where we have both of those resources. And I guess that would be fine. Sure, let's do that. And we just need to put it on this belt next to green. And we need to get the spent metal carriers in, of course. And I think we just want to grab a little bit more iron for carriers. Do it right here. Whoops. Let's just get the car a little bit out of the way. So, assembling machine. Currently doing four of those. I guess we scale the red to four as well. How did we do the other thing? Let's try and imitate that. The input of the carriers up here, the resource input down here. Let's just do that. I don't think we messed anything up here. That's where we needed it. Why is this not all correct at this point? How have I messed that up? Is this the wrong thing? If we wanted a four tile thing there and a four tile thing there, yes, yes that seems to be a problem. But we did also make a mistake in here. And have built this from that, so I guess that's why. Well, we'll just try and do this right anyway, I guess. And I'm out of underground. Nothing in there. Nothing to build it with. Great. I already hate all of this pipe we just put down. That is annoying when driving around. 
do we not have a buffer of this anymore? That seems like a little bit of a waste. Let's reintroduce that. And let's try and speed this up a little bit. Hopefully enough. And we just pick up some stuff to make more ourselves. That would probably help. We need basic undergrounds as well. That's just stone. And iron. Of that. We could have just taken some belt here. Here we have production as well at this point, it seems. Just go with this. Don't want to produce that many on oh gear wheels, I mean. So that is the spent carriers. Just make more of us, and this is not the correct recipe. Something like that. And let's just copy paste this as well. How many are we storing in here? That's way too many, I think. Yeah. Actually, let's just not store anything up here at least. I don't really care. So you make those, we put in iron. Output it. And we just merge that. Good. it was keeping up but let's do it anyway and i think this is all good then then we are getting red metal carriers let's just grab some by hand Fine. And let's go to petrochemical processing to hopefully make some uh, resin. And 
put down a radar. <coughs> Done. Let's just put it right there. We need to make it a little bit more spacey. And let's not worry about those right now. Okay, so resin. We have that, we have that, we have that. We need to make these. Unless we have already put those in, no. We have not split any air down here yet. We should have hydrogen, and we do. So it's just this. Let's just add it to the list. I think we are able to do all of this now then. In it. Too much ox oxygen already. But that's fine. Now let's just put some nitrogen into a pipe. <coughs> Do we have any air filters? Yes. Good. Just out of curiosity, what is the ratios between these? 9 to 7, so let's just call it 1 to 1. You make air. So I think I used all of those. of you so let's just take three stacks so we can do something like this Split air. With these two. I guess we will just connect both of them and burn any excess uh, oxygen. And then this whole thing is limited by the nitrogen, which is fine. We want to do it like this though. This takes up quite a lot of space. In the horizontal direction at least. Could we do something like this? If we need to scale up the nitrogen production at some point, this is probably better. That's seven. Eight, nine. Should probably have finished one of these first. Yes, we don't need any solids, so let's just connect power. And this should be everything. And of course we don't have enough filters for that. Oh, I am not going to run back just for those yet. And we expect everything to run along here. Let's 
just get everything a little bit more ordered. Except that we need things to come out here. Oh no. I'm just gonna do this anyway. This needs to go into a new pipe out here somehow. I think we just do that. This needs to merge here. That was not the correct space. Good. Can we somehow integrate these into the build? If only it was nitrogen we needed to get rid of. I guess we could just switch these outputs around. I think that actually makes sense. Let's do it. And all in the name of not wasting too much space. Which we have a lot of anyway, but... Plus this needs to be fixed as well then. Let's clean that. Cleans in. And put... No. Wait, what? <laughs> Why am I so bad at this? Doesn't make any difference. Unless we can put it all the way in here. But then there's no space for power. Else we would have to do something like that. And then we don't even have the space for the overflow valve. Am I just being stupid? I think I am. Let's just undo all of this. And just accept that we need a little bit more space. Possibly. Wait, now I feel like I'm being stupid again. But I'm not committing this time. If we do that. And put one of these down. Can't put it in there. Because then there's no power, but we can put it here. Why? Let's put this on the other side for realism. Yeah, that's not good. It would be so nice if you could just flip the input of this, but you can't. I feel like there's a good solution to this, but let's not waste too much more time here. And speaking of time, unfortunately, that's all we have time for in this episode. So thank you all for joining me, and I'll see you next time. Bye.